This is the new bipolar broadhead. These have a shear pin, as you can see. It's, all it is is a piece of fiber optic. There's no clips, O-rings, or anything to hold the blades in here, but a stainless steel rod, which is the pivot point. And then you got a shear pin, which breaks on impact. Much easier to replace and much easier to keep together in your quiver so they don't open up. And this blade here fits over the locking pin and fits over the shear pin. Now it's a pattern that we have on this. And we're about to do, there's your broadhead. We're about to shoot it through a metal barrel and see how it holds up. It's got a shear pin and it's got a stainless steel with no threads to hold these blades in. This is a solid stainless steel rod, so you're not gonna have any failure with these blades breaking off or flying through the air when you hit bone. So we're gonna uh, shoot this through this metal barrel with one of these new Obsession snipers traveling at 300 foot a second with a hunting arrow, of course. And it's a good heavy arrow. So let's see what this thing is. Now, this is a heavy gauge barrel. Like I said, this is the bipolar broadhead. So we're gonna we're gonna do the barrel test. It 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 did it did have hog corn in it. Let's see what they do. We're gonna back up at about 20 yards. If you can get a clip on me drawing the bone. You ready? Got the head. The real test. Let's go see what this baby did. Well, look at there. Man, what a, huh, I'm pretty impressed with that. Look at the penetration. Now look at this side here. That is pretty sweet. Now, that's the new Bipolar. It's not the heck of a hole in a heavy gauge steel barrel and this is the first one ever shot through a steel barrel so we didn't know well now we know it held completely together i mean it just really did very well we have one little bend on the end as you can see but no breakage now we're going to pull it up. we're going to pull this broad head out and spin it and see what it does too awesome penetration do you notice it went all the way through and look at here folks it almost went through the other side of the barrel. Now that's impressive with an expandable broadhead. Now this expandable broadhead is called bipolar for two reasons. One, as you can see, it has a fixed blade and it has a two and a quarter inch cut. Now that's one heck of a broadhead. I'm impressed now.